It's race day in Budapest as we get ready for another round of the Formula One World Championship. We don't expect too many retirements at this track. There are plenty of current and former drivers with flawless finish rates here. In particular, Ralph Schumacher. He made it across the line in all 10 of his Hungarian Grand Prix starts. 14 corners then for our drivers to navigate at the 2.7 mile Hungaro ring today. It's six lefts and eight rights around a lap here with average speeds in the region of 120 miles per hour. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today, it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? Well, the throttle goes both ways, Crofty. You've got to have the discipline not to try and win the race on the first lap. So always be prepared to lift early and give those around you more space. Trying to be the last of the late breakers with half a dozen cars around you may pay off from time to time, but it's also a great way to lose your front wing. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Young superstar Max Verstappen starts from pole position. Sergio Perez lines up alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Sainz, Frost, Valtteri Bottas and Leclerc, Sonoda, Russell, Norris, and Daniel Ricciardo, Ocon, Schwartzman, Callum Eilert, and Stroll, Giovinazzi, Latifi, Marcus Armstrong, and Daniel Tictum. The owner driver, Mick Schumacher, Joe, and Nikita Mazepin. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track and get this Grand Prix underway. After the points finish last race, let's aim to keep the momentum going. Our margins are looking good right now. I think we've got room for some more investment.
Here we are in the HQ of our newest Formula One team. We've got an awful lot to talk about, so let's jump straight in. According to your latest quarterly report, your team is very cash rich. Now, is that a safety net or are you saving for something expensive? Your facilities here are looking a little dated compared to other teams. Is there a reason for that? Well, thanks a lot for inviting us here. It's been fantastic. Hate to drop this on you, but we could do with your expertise on this one. Thanks for stepping in and helping handle that. 